All right, hey, welcome to Reforged Night 2 SCP Live Theater event. I am Eric, I am Toad King of Toad King Studios. You might know me as Toad King 07. I'm also Eric, so feel free to call me whatever. I am here with the Site 42 crew. We are going to this live theater showing and we are gonna explore the Church of the Broken God. Uh, right now, uh, everyone else in the group, Sherm and Rad, are out there doing their intros. They're doing their perspectives. We're all gonna have separate perspectives, following separate storylines, talking to separate characters. It's all intertwined. It'll probably make a lot more sense if you watch multiple videos here, which will be live tonight and will be going up on Sherm's uh, Patreon and YouTube and his channels later on, okay? So, welcome those who are checking us out. Uh, this is a live theater thing going on in LA tonight. It's Fringe Fest. We are gonna explore some fun stuff. Okay, so we gotta get going. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay. So, let's flip that camera. Alright. As best you can. Sorry. We're all going to get very close, but it's only temporary. I'll stand here. <laughs> Alright, sir. Oh, yeah, let's squeeze in a bit more, a bit more in here. I'm coming. You can fill in this middle space here, it's alright. Just make sure you're within the sound of my voice. In this production of Reforged, performing as part of the Hollywood Fringe Festival 2024. Celebrating its 14th year with over 350 different shows, workshops, and parties throughout Hollywood. Be sure to pick up a festival guide in the lobby and check out more shows through the month of June and into July with the Fringe Encore series. Please note the emergency exits, which may be in front or behind you. When the show is over, please make a swift exit through these doors. If you would like to speak with the cast, you may do so after we have struck and loaded out onto the curb. The Hollywood Fringe acknowledges that we are on the unceded lands of the Tonga, Peach, Gabrolinos, and Gabrolenos. Our statement serves as a practice as we commit to furthering our connection to the indigenous communities past, present, and emerging. Take a breath. You have been summoned. Robert Bumaro, the sage leader of the Broken Church, has disappeared. He has left behind, however, a blueprint, a mysterious artifact with the power to dictate fate. The blueprint calls for an assembly where the worshippers of the broken god will elect a new leader, an omniseer. The most dedicated and pious among you will be chosen to cast votes. The power to decide who will lead the church may rest with you. Here you will find three different sects. The Broken Church, the Cogwork Orthodoxy, and the Maxwellists, as well as representatives of the secretive and ever-watchful Foundation. Each of you belongs to one of these groups, but while that is where your journey will begin, you are free to choose where you will go. Whom you choose to help, which leaders you support, and the impact you make on our story are all yours to decide. There are, however, some rules. Rule number one. Please do not touch any of the characters unless you are specifically invited to do so. They will extend the same courtesy to you. Rule number two. Please do not move any of the props unless you are specifically instructed to do so by a character. Rule number three. If at any point you feel the need to stop an interaction, or if a character feels the need to stop one with you, the phrase is time out with the accompanying T gesture. This will stop the interaction. Rule number four, any disruptive behavior or failure to follow instructions will result in either a verbal warning or ejection from the show, depending on the severity. Thank you. Welcome to the assembly. The assembly. Go, go, go. Oh, 
Okay. Make your way down to the end of the assembly hall where you can join the rest of our congregation. Well, there we go. Welcome, welcome. Hello. Welcome to the assembly, everybody. Please fill in the space on either side. There's plenty of room. Come on in. Hello, hello. Hello, everybody. Please, either side will do fill in. Fill in, fill in, children. Fill in. Can you move closer? Come down a little bit this way. Circle around, circle around. You guys can also come. You guys can also come. sent directly to Mecca. You know, we have a saying here in the God word. It's the squeakiest wheel that gets the grease. Oh, did it go the scrap heap? Oh, <laughs> oh, you <laughs> This is holy ground! Violence 
of any kind is forbidden. You heard the speaker. Step off. There will be plenty of time for good nature debate later on in the evening. Yes. Now, so back to last but second, but certainly not least, we are the Church of Maxwellism. Well, you can applaud. I'm Morgana Blackwell and their leader and CEO. We are the sect that cares about the future and our advancement. We share our fellow sex enthusiasm for this blueprint to unite all three sects under one ruler whose commandments are divinely blessed and undeniable. A very wise idea. I couldn't agree more. And I also must acknowledge our allies from the foundation. Thank you for having us. It's a pleasure to be here with you all. No, no silence! In the interest of fostering peace this <laughs> evening, your foul presence will be tolerated so long as you do not interfere. But do not think that you are welcome. If you overstep, I am sure I am not alone in taking offense. <laughs> now, gathered faithful, throughout the evening we will have four votes on what laws our church will adopt. When the time comes, cast your votes, and the winning law will be forged into the blueprint, binding and absolute. And as the assembly draws to a close, the most senior members of each sect will also have a chance to vote for our Omniseer. Now remember, faithful, this is a very important decision. So converse with your fellow church members. Take stock in the information you get because you may vote for whomever you deem fit. We each bear great responsibility this evening. The success of our great work, the rebuilding of our God, may very well rest in the decisions we make here tonight. So as you consider what shall be, I urge you to remember that in order to build the strongest base, you may have to burn what's already been built. I wonder if any of you will have the faith. We shall see. Let the assembly begin. All right. Well then. Cut work. Form up in the center area. Broken church. We have a lovely area. Nice. So we are starting off night two here. This is a live, interactive, immersive theater event themed around SCPs, it's themed around the Church of the Brook God group of interest. So we are going to be talking to various actors and characters throughout this story, trying to find out what's going on, trying to help or hinder as we see fit. There are three perspectives mine, Rad's, and Dr. Sherman's. You can find them on YouTube and TikTok. Uh, I have links on social media. If you check me out there, you can find them. Uh, let's get going. Let's don't want to fall behind here. You are our favorite intern. You are our My name is Greg Blasman. And I'm proud to welcome you all officially to the Cogworth Workshop. Allow me to introduce the rest of the team for the evening. This is my second in command, Sadie Morgan. Each and every there are one saboteur within the Congress. So if you want to engage on you, have to say some five underhanded shows. This is my son, my pride and joy, Richie Glutzman. Hi there. He is a whiz when it comes to tinkering, and if his visions he gets directly from the king himself or anything to go by, you should be in for it. Allow me to introduce my last but not least is Dean Wilcox, President Spy Master of the Cogwork Warlords. If you wish to know everything and anything about the members of this church, speak to them. It's made. Hero of many battles, I'm 
As the speaker done. mentioned, we are here to vote for our new Omnisphere. Yeah. We are the a select chosen few of you have yeah. earned the right to vote in that. Well, 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 what you right. all can as well do is help us out with these tasks for the evening. These tasks, which is in various housekeeping and perhaps an interesting normal tasks, will help the card work grow even stronger this assembly. Now, if you all are very diligent, you will be ranked up, and those who have ranked up a considerable amount will be deemed the highest honor of Mechain Optimus. Just because you may not be Mechain Optimus doesn't mean you can't vote in any of it. There will be various votes for laws throughout the evening that will, let's just say, gain the cop a little bit of a bonus if we manage to win that. To get started, we're going to assign sponsors now. Sponsors are the people who are going to be guiding you throughout the evening. It will be one of the four of us, and it will be sort of the, taking you through the various tasks throughout the evening and giving you instructions on where to go. Please feel free to pick any one of the four of us, and if you're feeling a bit indecisive, we then will help you choose. Alright, you mean strong? The can be praised? Let the assembly begin. Go right ahead. We go, please, team. We're safe. Team Greg, move up. Hello. 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 You have the chance. All right. <laughs> okay, everyone. Let's do some introductions. What are your names? I'm Daniel. Daniel. Jonathan. Jonathan. Eric. Eric. Eroy. Eroy. Nice to meet all of <laughs> There we go. <laughs> so, I don't typically sponsor just about anybody. My former sponsor was the former leader of the convoy himself. So, you're going to need to prove yourself. However, it's very easy. I'm going to ask you a couple simple questions and they will prove if you're worthy. What are your greatest strengths and weaknesses? I'll start with that. My greatest strength is actually I have quite a bit of um, uh, artificial machinery uh, churning in my stomach, where it seems to be a human's uh, rib cage is actually not. Oh, tremendous. You have some augments on it. It's great to hear. Else? My greatest strength is I can speak with Tremendous. And weaknesses. Disorganization. Understand. Yes. Major disorganization. Greatest strength is creative problem solving. Greatest weakness is easily distracted. Altruism and sincerity. All right. Uh, don't know. Okay. It's all good. <laughs> my, my greatest weakness is my eyes have not been on <laughs> That's all good. You know, we have a full vision program here at the Concord, oh, right, right. <laughs> along with dental, general health, uh, 401k, um, paid over time, at least double your hourly rate, right? and once you're full membership, you replace an entire limb for free. <laughs> all right. Now, one last question. How can we form these strengths and weaknesses all together as a powerful force? <laughs> Mm. Well, you can speak with dolphins. <laughs> I don't see any here tonight, but um, can you speak with anything else? Um, hawks. I've had some conversations with hawks before. How about people? Are you good with talking to people? No. <laughs> oh, is it a weakness talking to people? <laughs> I think it's a strength. Okay, good, good. We can work with that. We have altruism, right? Kindness? Yeah. So you could be, you could be help us talk to people. Okay. Yeah. Right. 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 You'd be a good diplomat. Yeah. Yeah. We don't even have to mean it. We can just pretend to be nice. And you've already got some robot augmentation going on. All right. And subconsciously, they will sense my strength of machinery and will actually uh, gravitate towards you. What was your strength? Uh, creative problem solving. Okay. So oh, okay. We're, we're, so, we're working on that one right now. We're creatively solving this problem. All right. Well. 
This is the type of conversation I like to hear. Problem yeah, solving. Thank you. I'm going to borrow this since you seem occupied. Yes, of course. Problem solving and strategizing are just what we like to hear in the Cogwell Orthodoxy. As such, you've officially earned my union membership cards. I'm going to pass a pen around. We are rather limited on pens, unfortunately. If you please, feel free to fill out your name, preferred pronouns, and then I, Greg, and your sponsor on the very first page. Once that's all said and done, I will gather a stamp to get you officially stamped in, and shortly after that, we will have a little ceremony to swear you in as card carriers within the top card. You can get to some of the more nitty-gritty tasks. Do you be so, so, so kind as to write mine actually for me? Uh, Eric with a C, E-R-I-C, and he, him. So. Is that one of our new anomalous phone devices? <laughs> yeah. You know, it's tremendous what our craftsmen are coming up with these days. Thank We're you. We're able to simulate full iOS these days. It's yeah. Incredible. Incredible technology. That's why I'm excited to be a part of the Church of Broken God. <laughs> well, one of the sects, anyways. Yes. Honestly, we're the only pure true sect of the group, but I'm excited to see what happens. You know? Exactly. Yeah. So your name as well? Hey, Greg. Your name yes. Yes. Cox, these are ready to go, ready to get stamped. Yeah. Bill Cox has the stamp as well. Oh, great. Oh, yeah. Sadie, you can go ahead and stamp them. So what made you arrange to get a Word on the street, word in the ocean, the depth. Tremendous. Here's your strong connection, your union. The benefits sound really good. Of course, of course. If you'll excuse me, let me please secure my stamp. What's up? What are union dues? Union dues are what everyone in the Cogwork has to pay to secure them. What are they? What are they? No, what's the number? Yeah. It's a number. About a hundred bucks a year? Yeah, that's not right. bad. Not bad. Okay, uh, who, do you still have the stamp? Oh, yes. Did you put your last one? No. One. Later when I want to show people, I want to I think we get to keep them. Oh, you do get to keep them. Right. Right. Yeah, you guys get to keep them. Ooh. If you like to write any notes as you go along, you know, so we get my Yeah, but uh, yeah, we're kind of low on your I should take that up with the speaker. It's like, you know, if you know we're coming, why are there more pens in here? Yeah, they're definitely like, Hold on listen, I don't want to go all competing on digital, like, I'm just being adopted a little bit from the Cogwork. Hey, call me Greg. I'm sorry, sorry about that. Oh, it's all good. I've been like, metaphorically. Yeah. All right, are we all stamped at the county pool? Indeed. All right, then let the ceremony begin. Richie, it's time. Richie, Richie, we're doing the thing. There you go. Sometimes you just gotta like yell. Yeah, yeah. Wilcox, sponsor time. Yeah. Time to do the thing. All right. May everyone please raise their right hand and repeat after me. I, state your name. I, Eric. Uh, we have some jokes to do this evening. All right. Do hereby swear. Do hereby swear. To commit my body and soul. To commit my body and soul. Towards the rebuilding of Mechaim. Towards the rebuilding of Mechaim. I affirm the divinity of Analog. I affirm the divinity of Analog. And let go of the discord of digital. And let go of the discord of digital. I add my hands. I, I add my hands. To the hands of my comrades. To the hands of my comrades. I add my voice. I add my voice. To the voices of the faithful. To the voices of the faithful. And I add my heart. And I add my heart. To the hearts. 
of the family! To the hearts of the family! Alright, you're all officially card carriers with us. Requires the use of your digital devices. Yes, please. Overlook it. All clockwork. All clockwork, this bad boy. But like, it wouldn't be that bad. If we're just like. Uh, Gotta wind it every day. Yeah. Keep it wound. In order to achieve the goals we design. So we can like start talking about that like idea I have for bringing in a little digital. We'll have a referendum on it next week. Next week. Now big strokes of the assembly. There's greater things happening here. You know. I'm basically doing like the It's a week, you know. I, I, I have the stretch enough to push it to it. Alright chat, so we're in with the Cogsworks over here, uh, going to try to rise in the ranks, get sponsored, all that stuff. Uh, got to vote right now, so I'm going to pause just for that, just to scan that, so I'll be right back. If you see a gray screen, that's on purpose, be right here. Uh, hanging out. Back. If you see a gray screen, that's on purpose, be right here. Uh, hanging out. Okay. What sounds more appealing to you? Do you want to do a rather guerrilla marketing campaign, or do you want to do some scout work and spying? Spying. Yes, spying. Spying. All right. So, as you saw before there in the opening introductions, the Maxwellists, led by Morgana, are a rather digital-focused set. So. We are trying to figure out what exactly we're voting on one of these. Of I can't, can't have trouble. Like, yeah, yeah. I left um, my glasses in the, the core car. of uh, YouTube. Is go to um, let's is it just one of them. Yeah. Um, I was gonna say we could have Greg maybe break it down real quick for you once he's done here. Uh, basically, just like three different ideas proposed by each of the different groups. She's our spy. Speak to her in regards to the spying on the cog work and for the max. Sorry, my words are tied. And figuring out what their plan is for the evening. Can you guys do that for me? Yeah. yeah. All right. Yeah. Greg, would you be able to help our uh, oh, yes, founding member here? Uh, no. Is it fledgling? I'm having trouble I'm reading, reading it right now. Do you want me to read it for you? Sabotage. She has a device that, when placed on the supercomputer, should siphon away energy. Hello. Are you sent over here in terms of uh, the Maxwellist? Wonderful. Please come in. I was just speaking to these three about it. They discovered that the Maxwellists are working on a supercomputer, which will allow them to increase their numbers exponentially by recruiting people worldwide and identifying the best possible Maxwellists. We need to sabotage this computer, siphon away its power. Now, things right there has a device that the two of us have been working on. I put a bit of analog code in it. If it is placed on the supercomputer and stays there long enough without the Maxwellist noticing, it should siphon away the power and disrupt it. Are you all up for that? Yeah. Yes? yeah Wonderful. It. And speak with Sadie right over there. All right. Great. Thank you. Okay. Uh, yeah. Yeah.
Do we all? Do we all? Wait, no, some, yeah, some of you might have to just grab some of you. Put me in the Maxwell. Yeah. Good luck, you guys. Yeah, be sneaky about it. Sounds like heavy metal. It imbues a novelist's whole story of sex. Alright, so we are trying to get to. So. That black thing on the table yeah, yeah, is the supercomputer. Okay. okay. <laughs> we gotta stop not walking. <laughs> right. So. Okay. All right, so we are trying to track it. Something I can help you with, my friends. Yes, I, I actually had some second thoughts about which sector I've been part of. I, I, I don't like the analog. I, I, I want to move to the future. I've heard you guys actually work with digital and in fact are uh, miles of in, the, in the future of where they are. Is that true? Absolutely, every word of it. Well, how do I how do I get started? How do I join? Well. Quite, quite simply, you just have to have an interview with the boss, Morgana Blackwell. Okay. If you just answer a simple questions, make sure that your values at part line up with what it means to be a Maxwellist. We'll have you do a couple of simple errands to make sure that you fit in with the other lower ranks. But once you complete that, you'll be able to start sowing the seeds of your own path towards success within the Maxwellist. Wonderful here. What was your name? I'm Talon the Brother. Talon the Brother. A pleasure to meet you all. I have some colleagues here assisting me with some business. I must take my leave. Sure. All right. All right. All right. Good work. Well, no, I think we, I think we can back. I think, no, I think we gotta leave it. One of the reasons I enjoy her company. Come with me. I have to interrupt real quick. Are we supposed to bring the device back or leave it on the? Leave it on the computer. All right. <laughs> Uh, 
Tony. Away from the speaker's angry rage. I wish it was. Is no longer Me, you were the one responsible for the initial setup and design of the party. So why don't you tell me what you did to sabotage it before this whole event could be assembled? What do you want? What do you want? I'm interrupting my mission. I'm on a mission too. Well, my mission's more important than yours. Oh yeah. Relax, guys. All right, all right. Let's calm down. I think we can all agree. Anytime soon. I you can't do stuff here. I'm doing stuff here. Can I, also I am doing all kinds of stuff. Did you steal all their pens? <laughs> Gracias. We have a pen. That's great. I got it. I'm pretty sure I got it right on time. And I was like, I'll take all the money. Let's go. Come on. Unfortunately, I have to report that our, our device got noticed. It was discovered. But we were also not the only group that was putting devices on their device. You were able to initially place it, though, yes? Yes. That should have been long enough for my code to infiltrate the system. Yeah? Yes. All right. Well, this is the man who did it, so nice Very work. Very good work. Right. Very good work. first, and I read it. <laughs> well, uh, so which one's Sadie? Sadie is the one um, with the goggles, Flight goggles. on her head there. Oh. All right. So, yeah, they are on to it. But glad to hear it was just enough time. It should be enough to just rip their systems and put them behind for the foreseeable future. They seem to be pretty confident that they, the analog was not going to be able to do anything for their digital stuff. <laughs> that is their mistake, Eric. That is their mistake. Let your sponsor know that I recommend you be elevated if you have not yet been elevated. Oh, well, thank you kindly. Good work. Thank you for reporting it. We'll continue on. There's a lot of people over here. Self-centered assholes like the Maxwell's, just, just a little, little taste. 
Interestingly, Sonia Sotomayor is on both. It might be in the broken church's possession, but that's all I said. Yeah. Yeah. The broken church would never kill my wife. Uh, but, uh, I think the egg that was, that's my, my back Do you remember everything for Mexico? I don't know what the fuck you're talking about, but please start. The Gulf of Mexico. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That was it for you. Uh, it went boom. We're all trying to rebuild Mexico, but they tried with the heart and your heart with the heart. Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. I thought he got banned. I'm just waiting for him. Now we know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Right, we'll, we'll come back. Right. You should write stuff down. <laughs> and you should be more clear. Uh, excuse me, I have a question. I, so that's an exquisite box. You know who whose setup this is? This is Richie's setup, my son, right over there. All right, thank you. Of course. Greg. Yes. Real quick, sorry. I uh, wanted to let you know that we did the sabotage thing. Oh, tremendous, Eric. We got the device on their device. It did get found out. It also seems we are not the only group trying to mess with their device. Um, I was also told to tell you that I should be elevated? Yes, yes. You are now officially a factor of Mecha. What? That's wonderful. Oh, I didn't take anything. I'm just looking. Uh, what's, your, what's, your, what's your name, friend? Tony. Tony? Friend. Tony, I've already been pissed off today because people were asking me questions about things I didn't understand about my dead wife. So, apologies. I was fascinated. Is there something you're looking at? Well, six months ago, we were just looking at you. And I see you got a bunch of candles. I'm looking for something for Okay. No. I, uh, right, Chad. So we've been able to get up in the group a little bit. Okay, that's a good thing. Uh, sabotage is caught, but hey, we got it in place. Did what we need to do. Uh, we are now trying to figure out what's next here. Uh, we've run into Anna already. Rad. Haven't seen much of Sherm. Um, I forget which group he's following tonight. I think it might be the Foundation. No, it's the Maxwell. That's who he's following. If you want to see his point of view, check out his shirt, his uh, stream, which is going to be on YouTube. Um, you need help there? All right. Gotcha. <laughs> Just trying to help out as he call across the table. Um, so. Uh, just gonna take a small break. I'll be right back across the table. Um, so. Uh, just gonna take a small break. I'll be right back. Is your good at diplomacy? This ought to be helpful. 
Maybe I am, maybe I'm not, but I'll tell you this. You sh I didn't do anything. Okay. I didn't do anything. Let's do this. Yeah. I totally sabotaged the Totally sabotaged yeah, Sadie. What? What's up? My sponsees here and I have, uh, let's just say some, some words for you. Okay. They have reported to me that you are rather, let's just say, strongly sympathizing with the nice folks. Okay, well that's a, those are big words. Those are big words. I wouldn't say that I'm sympathizing with the Maxwell's. I'm just saying what I've been always saying, we're going to have a little bit of digital. I will take this. And I have also heard that you have a quote-unquote fuck the patriarchy thing. What? No, that is very alleged. I would never wear something like that at the assembly. Open your jacket. Uh, okay. Listen. I understand. They're old. I understand. Fucking old. That, but they are well tenured. They're well tenured. They don't represent what the power is now or what we want it to be. But you do know that standardization takes time. Standardization takes time. Because if we stray too far from it, we'll stray from McCain's will. God, we're gonna lose everyone from the Congress to Maxwell. Is that what you heard? We have a strong contingent here this evening. You yourself have various sponsors. I do. I do. But what's stopping them from leaving? Is the referendum not enough? No. It's the assembly. Big strokes. Big moves. Let's go. This is your new fort. We forged within the church of the three back page. Please now, hear me out. Take your left and your right wrist and put them together. I respect and you. And erase them towards Deep. Mickey. I do. You were the daughter I never had. And I truly mean now, that. As I come to each of you, indicate where you would like to be anointed. Oh, so your forehead, please, your arm, back of your head. Bear with me for tonight, okay? I know I'm a lot. I know I'm old. I know I'm a bit crotchety. I know I'm a bit stuck in my ways. But I am fighting for them. Okay. I appreciate that. And Referendum will happen. In the image of Fushi, we assemble ourselves. Thanks for helping out. Sophia, yeah, I don't the exactly know what you mean. I guess it's supposed to be a tool that actually is going to be more playable. But I'm playing because I'm playing the music. Man. You won't even remember what you did. Where did you get that from? Listen, I appreciate you wanting to get some power. Please. Refrain from now, using mind over the device. And final ten. Oh, myself? Is that okay? Our God you is for yourself. Our God. As your leader, I would personally request you not make things that alter my sacred. I don't know where they got that from. I'll take it I know. I thought I didn't say that. Sometimes they have to test things out. Oh, I can. You can become. Let's be honest. Thank you. Thank you. I'll take care of this. Well, thank you. Thank you for your assistance. Please. So what exactly is that you got there? I can trust you, Eric. Yes. Yeah, yeah. It's a anomalous music box. The person, anyone that listens to it becomes more agreeable. Hmm. It's a subtle effect. It's very useful in negotiation or interrogation, in my opinion. Well, you got a few items over there, huh? That are anomalous? Oh, only the music box. Oh, uh, okay. Well, besides, obviously, my mask and yeah. other augmentations. Yeah, well, I meant, I meant in the box over there specifically. Obviously, you guys all have anomalous attributes going yes. on. No, that's only a stapler in crafting supplies. Uh, Those are not anomalous uh, in any way, I promise you. Uh -huh. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge, say no more, say no more. <laughs> Who have you all been uh, working with, Eric? Um, well, Greg 
sent us to you, and then you right, sent the us yeah. to the Maxwellists. And then since I've been kind of wandering, I, I'm kind of between tasks right now. In between. Yeah. So if you have anything I could help with, that would be great. There, there is, actually. Since you seem so... I don't think that music box will help us again, but do you find you're skilled at diplomacy? I'm pretty good at diplomacy. Have you met Richie yet? Uh, no. Richie, um... He's Greg's son, and he's had a lot of pressure put on him. Yeah. I want to make sure that he doesn't have any complaints that could disrupt the cloud work, that could send the gears on shift, so to speak. But he doesn't have any complaints? But Richie doesn't, yes. Yeah. I, as a spy master, I don't only watch out for external threats, but also internal threats. Mm. If you could speak with Richie and make sure that any problems he has, he, he tells you, and you let me know, and we can figure out the best way to get Greg to compromise on it. Yes? Oh, yeah? Yeah. Let me know what he says. Gotcha. The wow. Maxwell is won the vote. Mm. But you guys got the first vote, right? We did. Yes. Good to hear, good to hear. Union strong. Union Thank strong. You Thank you. Talk about something important. curious what you were looking at there oh, yeah, so just, um, just some friendly banter between me and uh, being a friend of mine you know yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, a cog works yeah, or, or yeah, someone yeah, just, uh, friendly, you know, friendly banter amongst the cogs you know okay okay and the works, and the works yeah cog and work I was that's gonna why, uh, that's why you say union strong you know union strong, union strong. Union strong. thank you yeah. 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 I was gonna say this, Are you here yeah I'm here at the cog works I've been working my way up help with submission uh, Greg Nice. Yeah. Cool. Oh no, just uh, just your meeting response. Uh, yeah. Yes. He's talking to you. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, wonderful. wonderful. Well, is there anything I can help you with? You're his son, right? Yes. All right, great. Well, no. Um, I was wanting to know your part in the Cogsworth. Well, I'm very much the. Uh, uh oh, sounds like something important's happening. I'll, I'll circle back, I'll find you. 
within the church itself. They form right at its inception. The main reason is that they are unheard of is because, they, well, let's just say they have rather nihilistic beliefs. You see, we here at the Cogwork, along with the Broken Church and the Maxwellists, believe that Mekane must be rebuilt 
in order to be brought back. Yeah. The Entropy Choir believes that Mekay lies within all machines, and that they must rust and decay and be destroyed in order to bring Mekay back. Which also means the end of the world. They are not heretical. However, I personally would like to live. And it, or, I don't know about all of you. Yeah. I, yes. yes. I can go on it. Yeah. It's within our best interest to keep up the good work. You all have done incredible work so far this evening. So, everyone please keep fighting the good fight. Keep the union strong. And we shall ensure that the cog work will live to see another day. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, head on over. Don't take anything physically, but take as many pictures as you can, scan any QR codes. We don't want to raise any suspicions with Morgana herself. Yeah, but all right, roll team. What? Do you have something else you were sticking around? Uh, no, I was just checking to see what we were doing here. Uh, talking to Richie. Seems like a good guy, a good boy. He is. I'm proud of my son. Yeah. You know, as a matter of fact, um, if you wouldn't mind a bit later, I might have something yeah. for you. Oh, yeah? Yes. I'll come back. I got to talk to Richie uh, a, little, a little bit. Um, yeah. Funny enough, it pertains to both of us, but I won't keep it. All right, all right. Well, Richie was talking to his fences, but I think he's done now, so I'll come over now. Thank you. A steam streamer, steam steam, a steam streamer, and a cog fashion fastener. Yeah, don't tell me It's like this little project that I'm working on. Yeah, I I'm gonna get some Yeah, thank you. All right, back to what I was about to tell you. I'm well, sorry, like a quick re reintroduction. My name is Richie Bletzman, and you are Eric. Nice to meet you, Eric. Nice to meet you, Richie. I'll get you guys in one second. I'm very much the uh, the mechanic of the cog work. I uh, you know I build things, whatever the cog work needs. I make. Um, I'm also known as the Golden Child. A very pretentious name, I know. They call me yeah. the Golden Child of the cog work, mainly because I am. Um, long story short, I'm blessed by McCain, and I get visions from him every now and then, around like once a month or so. Yeah. And these visions are these incredibly glorious machines that he asks me to build for him, and and I do. You know, sometimes it takes me a few weeks, sometimes it takes me a few months. You know, and sometimes the projects do back up a little bit, but I, I get them done eventually. Last time. Last time he sent me a vision, I think it was a well, yeah, he wanted me to build a well, and that got done within a couple of months, which was really nice, really nice water flow for the new, for the new commune, but um, the most recent one that I had was uh, really interesting, have you heard of the, um, have you heard of the Colossus? Uh, no, I have not. No, really, really old machine that the Mechanites built way back in like, an ancient Greek, a really, really long time ago, but he sent me a vision of a new updated version of that. It's kind of scary, but you know, if that's what he wants me to build, then you know, who am I to deny him? You know? Yeah. But, uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, I don't mean to interrupt you. To interrupt you, but uh, yeah. No. I need to feel free to, to help them. Better. For sure. All right. How can I help you guys? Oh, we got hurry! Yes. 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 Woohoo! Here, why don't you guys come on? Hi. Well, our longest alliance has been five years, which isn't great, but it's better than nothing. Yeah. The cog work isn't great at making us know what it is. The call is like, you know, we're writing this matter for those who Yeah! <laughs> Well, that's going to be the challenge. My dad's been asking me to make an alliance with the factions. And right now, I'm stuck between making an alliance with the Broken Church and the Foundation. We could do both, but I think one should take the priority for it. Uh, long story short, we are the sister sect of the Broken Church. Uh, we did split off from here about 200 years ago or so. And Foundation, we I don't know. 
It's very much a touching subject. Because they, they actually show the foundation does uh, constant raids on some of the factions, including ours. The last raid was really destructive. It was, it's not pretty, but we, we have to keep in contact with them for several reasons. I know Sydney keeps in contact with them, but uh, it's, more, it's more of a we have to situation. We're not, not a we have to. The Brookie Church, though, we're not exactly the best of terms, but we're very much, you know, here at the assembly, we're, we're trying to foster kids. So, so, um, what do you think? Well, if that's the case, I might send a few of you to talk to Angelica. She's the current leader of the Brookie Church. Oh, she's actually right over there in the white shirt that I had. Um, I feel like if there's something to make an alliance, you guys should probably talk to her about the similarities between the Brookie Church and the Oliver Orthodox. We're, we're still very much related to one another. We're really big on tradition. We're really big on community and our sense of duty to the king. So I think that's, that's a good topic to get to. I'll get you in one second real quick. Um, I'm so, I'm so sorry. I'm so Hey, Greg. Do you have anything for me? Are you wanting to speak to Sadie? Uh, no, uh, uh, they came over to talk to you. Although right. I don't know that I have anything. I've kind of talked to Richie and he's talked about working on making alliances. I believe that's something he's, he's yes. working on. Do you have something for me, friend? I appreciate this. Now you guys don't have to share the pens <laughs> as much. Yes, yes. You know, there is now a potential deal in the works with the Maxwellists. Yeah? It's surprising, I know, but considering the new threat of the Entropy Choir resurfacing, it perhaps may be in our best interest to team up as a group. I wondered if that might be uh, sort of a catalyst for getting a little bit more harmony between the different sects. To my knowledge, they have limited numbers, but it's better to play safe than sorry. We don't know if they're hiding anymore. Yeah. I was going to say, part of my draw to you and you you folks was the union and yes. how that reminds me of cogs, you know, yes. clockwork, working together you in do. small pieces. If you take one cog out of a machine, yeah. the whole thing will stop. Yeah. Do you think that applies to the, the larger broken, uh, the Mecca's worshippers, just how the different sects, do they need to work together better? You know, perhaps so. Hmm. Perhaps I am a bit too harsh on the Maxwellists. I mean, they, they definitely are different, you know. Digital, you know, what is going on there? It's not even analog. You know, <laughs> I was considered different back in the day. Yeah, you back know, in the day? I was you know, rather open to pushing forward for more, um, let's just say advanced in terms of the cogwork technology, so yeah? I guess I'd be calling myself a hip crew if I'm not accepting it digital. Yeah. So what do you have for me? I, I, I was here uh, in the interest of forging alliances, and it seems like nobody's really interested in that right now. I, for my I am. You are? I am. Okay, the rest of your faction told me that they weren't, so this is actually huge news for me. Um, okay, because you guys won the first vote, right? And the Maxwellists won the second vote. And we were trying to partner the Maxwellists with the Broken Church, maybe, and see then if we could get y'all interested, but that's super I'm wondering on what terms would you be interested in partnering with the Maxwellists? I would be interested in partnering up should there be an um, acknowledgement of the power of Emma. And along with that, information exchanges. I want personal access to all of the top projects of the Maxwellists, and in exchange, I'll give them our money. Alright, okay, pleasure doing business with you. Thank you very much. Pleasure doing business. Friends, what do you have for me? Yes. And after I just made this big whole spiel. Well, I also got a selfie with it. Post that on social media. Maybe we'll get a couple of likes. Um, well, perhaps. Oh, 
thank you all for your diligent work. Uh, um, I believe it might be in our best interest now to perhaps... Can you all spread the word to the broken church about Morgana's artificial life extension? Yes. They're, they're next door, right? Yes. Okay. Thank you. Greg, I have something for you. It's another pen. Oh, thank you, Aaron. <laughs> yep, Holiday yep. You know, I'm more of a Motel 6, but, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know I appreciate it. Well, I'm still looking for the, mo the mythical Motel 9, but... <laughs> Journey continues. Okay. Um, I Richie, so you were talking about uh, alliances between different yes, sects here. I actually just um, sent a group of mine to make an alliance with the Roman awesome. Church. So yeah. Hopefully that goes well. Yeah. yeah. Well, so what do you feel? How do you feel about the other different sects? Because with this new choir, choir um, I was talking to Greg, and he was, I was like. Maybe they all need to work together against this. And honestly, I'm not, I'm not against that idea because um, it's required they're really keen on ending the whole world. Yeah, so that's not good. I don't think anyone else here wants to, you know, be gone in a big ball of flame. And, yeah, and yeah. So, um, I'm not against it. Like, I personally am not against that idea, but unless I'm not the guy in charge. Yeah, you think the, the Maxwell's would be interested in an alliance? You know, I feel like with everything going on, I feel like there's definitely a good chance different you know, putting differences aside. Yeah. What I'm worried about though is um, it's more is more Morgana. She's very Yeah. She's kinda of scary. She's really scary. I think some of your sponsors are there. Oh, right. So I think I kind of fell off the storyline here. Um, Got to see if I can get back into a part of something here. Maybe I can help some of these people talk to the broken Let the Maxwells know that uh, I would be willing to offer something in return. No, but, uh, of course, please let me know as soon as possible what they would like. What? Do you believe that there is something unusual about school? Alright, so the other is over there and it's not so far north here. Have a look in there, see if we can do it. Hi there, I, I'm actually a, a former, uh, or just current uh, member of uh, another sect, but I actually was really inspired by Morgana and I really wanted to be, be, be part of your church. I have a problem though, I want to make sure. I'm, I'm disturbed by what I see in Morgana's actual uh, history there. It looks like she's been looking up um, uh, uh, some, some uh, life, life uh, anti-aging, uh, longevity, uh, genetic factors. She's, she's been using it really artificially in her life. Wow. I'm very disturbed by this. Is this something that you guys have in the book and should approve of? Uh, we generally frown upon such things, but there are exceptions. Although I don't believe that we can make an exception for God. Yes, I agree with myself completely. So what is this? What implications is this? Do you think this has for, uh, for for your church? Well, we would need stronger evidence that she is up to something that would be considered for wretch. I can assure you that if I'm elected Omniseer, I will open a special inquisition into her behavior. Okay. But as for tonight, I'm not sure there's anything more we could do without stronger evidence. Do we, we see any stronger evidence? Uh, 
<laughs> no, no, no burning. That would be a trial, and then uh, we would discuss the penalty. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, do you, you think that she has a youthful countenance? Okay, we will look for more evidence if we need to. Thank, thank you so much. Okay. Thank you for bringing this to my attention. Mm. Is there anything I can help you with? Uh, not exactly at the moment. I was kind of going, following what these folks are up to. I see. Uh, There's concerning information about Morgana. Yeah. As you say, I'm from the Cogsworth group. And uh, there's just talk right now with this this choir coming back into the picture of the yes, groups yes. maybe putting some differences aside to kind of work together. Well, I would very much appreciate that. Yeah, yes. yeah. So. Uh, pleasure speaking with you. That would help expel a lot of Yes, it would. Okay. We're good. And also probably help your cause. I can try. Are you going to like say that, that digital is okay? I will. Alright, so we might need to help distract Max. Well, Mark as well. Max as well as. I don't know. It's uh, hard to figure out what. I can do right now to move things along. I need to discover more information, but I'm not quite sure how we're going to get to that part. I also think I need to vote on something, so I will have to pause here a second to get the scan in. I'm not quite sure how we're going to get to that part. I also think I need to vote on something, so I will have to pause here a second to get the scan in. Okay, we're back, but uh, figure out where we're going now. Number one saboteur for the Cogworks. Ah, yes, that is me. How's the night going? It's going pretty good. Yeah, um, yeah. You know, I seem to have found some uh, not so great information about Morgana. Yeah? Yeah, it seems like she's got some suspicious Google searches. And I'm also connecting the dots on something, but I don't think that's... It would be a lot if that the thing I'm thinking about is... Yeah? What, uh, what kind of a lot? So, um... You know, you're gonna stick with me. It's gonna be like a bit, a lot. So just great. Um, all right, I used all right. to be a Maxwellist. Okay. Back in the day. Um, I've heard that happens. People change groups. It's yeah, fine. Well, my parents died when I was 13, and uh, that I showed up to their funeral and didn't let me keep anything of them. And uh, you know. Yeah, I keep having this sneaking suspicion that maybe it wasn't just an accident. If that makes sense. Yeah. And I started thinking, and I was like, oh, who replaced them? It was Morgana. But that seems like really far fetched, I think. I don't know. What do you think? Uh, from what I know of that group, Maxwell's, they, uh, they do that sometimes. Ha didn't one of the members over there, Jules, isn't what, the, the secretary, right? Well, Jules used to be a Cogwork member. Yeah. Friends and, and everything, but, but she's stayed, she switched, huh? Yeah, um, it was not great, you know. It was, I took it really hard because, yeah. you know, like, you joined the people who abandoned me. You yeah. Know, so. Has she ever, like, thought about coming back? Um, I don't know. Mm. I would like her to come back. I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. we're good friends, but... Um, Does she have any connections? You know, if she was a part of you, this group. Yeah. Does she have any other connections? Like, I know you guys, you know, hurt a lot. 
Was there anyone else that she's like on better terms with or something? I'm not sure. I, I'm not even sure how she's doing in the back spot. Yeah? Nice back. Aww. Yeah. Um, yeah. Can you actually... Can you actually help me investigate Morgana a little bit? Yeah. Yeah. Files on her computer that I could do on her. Yeah. I want to see if you know, she might have kept any like evidence. Mm. You know, if it was her. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe I'm just like assuming too much. Well, so you want me to get access to her computer? Yeah. See if you can uh, go over to her computer and look around. She might have QR codes there. Yeah. Access to other documents. Mm. You know, if it's password protected or anything like that, I don't know if I can hack that. I mean, she's kind of working on it right now, so it's kind of wide open. Yeah. You might have to get her to step away, but uh. if you need help, you know, I, I can help distract. Did you already send another group over there to get that? Um. Because I thought I might have overheard that. Yeah. I might be able to help them. Maybe we've worked together with those with those yeah. sponsors. Yeah, I know I know they found some other information about Morgana that's been not so great. And actually mm -hmm. they're coming over here right now. Yeah, yeah what's up? Uh, we got some news about about your how Jules is feeling well, about stuff. Oh, we were just talking about that. Yeah. So, so, Toad King viewers, come on, get in here. <laughs> <laughs> You're breaking up our thoughts. <laughs> She is having sex with Bob, and I think we will for you to apologize for the last year's day. It makes a step. Love the forward. Wait, so they actually did break up in their fight? I thought it was kind of like a big break. You know how she knows, bro. Yeah, but like, <laughs> you don't get a fact. She definitely, she's more concerned with you about how you feel and how The word gal pal wasn't used, but it was heavily implied. Yeah, we, we're, we're really good friends, but I was kind of a, a massive bitch to her when she was. But she'd like to come over. She wants to come over. She just needs assurance that she'll be accepted and that she'll be protected. That's all she's she ready to forgive. She just wants to make sure that if she extends that bridge, she'll be there to catch her. Yeah. 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 She, she's asking about protection from Greg. Yeah. With the protection from Greg, Greg provides protection for her. I think I've never heard of her. Do you think I should like, go over and apologize to Person, like, like hug it out. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 Sorry. Sorry. Yeah. 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 <laughs> sure. <laughs> so I think it's making me more nervous. Okay, she yeah. might take it as a threat, and I just like. Yeah, it's fair. It's, it's been used for a lot of threats. <laughs>
Are they uh, what? Oh. Um, I, I don't campaign for Greg, but I know I would love it. Greg is the big one. Oh, that's um, I do know. I think it's like the same. Yeah. Uh, Hello? It is also now time for the fourth vote. Oh. I will come around the QR code as usual, and once again, there are four options. So yeah, and, and you know, even if even if you don't, I think it's important that I apologize to you because I was a massive Sure. Not a massive I Like this is a little spooky seeing you so Maxwell is like definitely giving me like flashbacks, but like I, you know, I'm not rich enough. The best for sure, like epaulets go like amazing. Like I, I genuinely love this. Yeah, um, I appreciate it. Yeah, yeah. Um, can I? Yeah, 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 yeah. They won't be in fact, I do have okay. to make my own. Oh, so much. oh, oh, yes. Um,
Well, thank you, Miss Blackwell. Okay. Oh, okay. I've got some good news. Do you? Yes. Would you like to speak over here for a second? I don't want to. Get a little bit of a little bit of a The doctor is amenable to the lines between us. As an individual and as a supplier itself, we are very good at this. Uh, also, the doctor is interested in the visit in my visual back. How, how you take that is up to you, but that is the news I've got. So, speaker commentary gives Curious if there's a way to get past it. If there's anything that might help me out. Well, let's see. What do we have? The fourth vote is now closed. The fourth issue to be. And we have. The fourth vote is now closed. The fourth issue to be closed. 
the fourth and should be originates from methane. So. Peer-reviewed inventions are allowed, however, any deviation greater than 1.0 from established technology is to be considered heresy. Oh. We can That's very bad. Sorry. Praise the Mekang.
recognizes their vote. Please go first. I believe our voters are caught up in the call for so let's see if they return. So they converts. Let's hope they all do us a favor and don't. <laughs> I'm a lot of black girls recognize these systems are protected. They have displayed the values of individualism, uniqueness, and talent. Juan recognizes their voices to be heard. Thank you. Alex and Colin Dwyer are the techno contacts of the broken church. They have demonstrated their piety, devotion, and loyalty to our traditions. Meccain recognizes their voices to be heard. And I can vouch. It could be sort of like Spuds McKenzie and Bud Lights, where he's not the CEO. Oh, oh, but the dog. Yes, yes, the dog. Yes. I remember the dog. Richie could be the dog for, for the mascot. Yeah, the well, mascot. Richie does have that dog in him. Absolutely. <laughs> yes, and he the does. <laughs> I do insist that if I do go, I want to see a lot of it. I understand the compromise you had to make. Maybe that may be 98.6% you know, analog and then the rest of it. Have my word. All right, thank you. I have a pen. I will try my best. You got this. Really good to break. We're trying to get you in the next Is there anything that we can say to her to convince you that you're the one who deserves it? They're going to go to the Lions Bay. Is there another so I appreciate your So we're going to show, and it's going to all work. It will. I trust Any more votes? I have my voting paper and my voting paper. Whoa! No. We'll, we'll talk later. We'll talk the Cogwork Orthodoxy are. Donations. Donations for the church. Yeah. Donations for the church. The Cogwork doesn't engage in super PACs. No, 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 no. We're donating to the church. Yo, what's up? She's probably excited. Funding the church. This is not a Dogecoin. What's wrong with you? What's the next big thing? Point one Bitcoin. I'm like changing them out. I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, I'm well, you're going down when I hack you. So my Wi-Fi power is well. If you can dodge your rent, you can dodge. Uh... We can have the entirety of the church gather around the blueprint for one final time. Yeah, no rule against it. I'm going in on that. I'm 
move up the ridge for a reason. Our assembly has come to its conclusion, which means that it is time for the final step of the blueprint, the ceremony of executed faith, where we name our army seat. But before then, <laughs> <laughs> the entropy choir and I would like to take just a brief moment as a gesture of good faith. We would like to bless everyone here tonight. I don't like the way you said that. We have all waited so very long for this moment. And I am overjoyed to finally bring it to you all. <laughs> Witness all of you the reforging of our God. What? We will all be... Hold it right there, speaker. We know what that object is. We're not letting you use it. May I remind our friends from the Foundation that they are not permitted to interfere. Angelica, Angelica. Unless that is, of course, an XK end of world scenario, which the speaker, using the blueprint and the uh, the Simon engine to the de deconstruct the world, uh, I think that counts. Oh, 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 end of world scenario. Oh, 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 oh. XK class, end of the world scenario does in fact mean deconstruct the world, and this is in fact a genuine article. Are you insane, speaker? I am simply trying to enact McCain's will. This evening. I truly thought that you all would be smart enough to see the truth by now. That our God cannot be reforged without his spirit. And I, I am the only one in this room who can see us to our paradise. The paradise that I have seen through our God. I and the only one who can see our souls united here and now. Look, well, that's your belief, Speaker, and that's not ours. I'm not willing to bet the world in which one of us is right. Just, we're gonna end this here and now. Melissa, I'd like you to defuse this situation. Get back here too. First one's free, Melissa. I'm A little confident, don't you think? Tell me, uh, speaker. What time is it? Oh! Who's that? Is he made of steel or something? You gotta hit him harder. Oh! Really what power is this? I said the first one was free, not the second one! Oh. Oh. <laughs> what is the You are uh, much stronger than you look. Melissa! Oh. 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 oh my god! Oh. 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 Melissa, get up! Warm wood. Uh. Come here! Oh. What is this? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Couldn't even kill me. Do you think an electric stick can? It's Tony's tech. We'll see. Whoa! 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 Come on! Come on! Come on! Oh my God! Over five. Over five. We relinquish this item and name the foundation. I'm afraid I cannot let you do that, Howard. We are all grateful for your help in preventing the end of the world, but the Simon is a relic of the broken church. If yeah. you wish for the foundation to continue its strong partnership with the church of the broken God, and if you wish to leave this place with your life, I suggest you hand it over. Fine. Foundation will honor the wish of the broken church. Thank you. Yeah, Howie! <laughs> <laughs> Get it, girl! Unfortunately, <laughs> Howard, you won't be leaving here alive. What? Oh! Not oh. oh. yeah. oh. oh. with the neurotoxin we've poisoned you with? <laughs> 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 it is exquisitely painful, but 
Mekane, please reveal to us who the next Omniseer will be for the next 31.41 years. Uh, congratulations, Greg. Promises, but Whoop. unlike other politicians, I'll actually keep them. Yeah. 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 You hear that, more, Honor? We can. <laughs> the only thing you should be counting is how many benefits you're going to be getting. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Under my leadership, everyone in the church shall see full health insurance. Yeah. 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 And if you so wish, we'll replace an entire limb for free. And I would also like to briefly say I appreciate the other sets here this evening. You all are incredibly powerful and talented in your own ways. And I believe that if we all work together, with a bit of course correction theme to require, but still. <laughs> And we'll talk later, we'll talk later. <laughs> we shall forge a new, united path for the church. Woo! Thanks to Unity, Mechane, and the real superpower of teamwork. Woo! Woo! Union Shrug! Union Shrug! The powers of community, camaraderie, and compassion what? shall prevail. Woo! Union Shrug! Yeah! Union Shrug! Union Shrug! Union Strong! Woo! Clap emojis! Thank you! Wonderful work! Right. Read SCP 6802 Soup Dog. That's a good one. <laughs> And on that note, on that note, we're going to call it a night. Thank you very much. All right, folks, thanks for watching. Uh, we all have to leave here. They have to set up, deconstruct, I mean, their setup. So uh, we'll let them get to that. Uh, again, you can watch the other perspectives of tonight uh, that Rad and Sherm did. You can also check out the other night we went here to the show and follow different characters, follow different storylines, different paths. Uh, it's all very unique, so check it out for sure. We'll see you again. To be fair, we're not the enemy at all. Okay, yes. We literally get a declaration.